so basically if a variable is dead when do we say that a variable is dead a variable is a dead a variable is dead if it is not used afterwards if you are not using some definition as i told you definition means assignment if you are not using some let's assume there is a assignment here v is being assigned a plus b now if you are not using this definition of v uh, afterwards afterwards you are not using any, ever okay you are not not using this definition ever then this variable v will be called dead and you can you can call this variable dead and you can eliminate this expression so this is the point an assignment to a variable v is called dead if the value of that assignment if the value of that definition okay that is not read anywhere so this is the point so dead code elimination basically removes the dead assignments from the intermediate representation so this dead code elimination is a optimization technique this is a very crucial technique because it will remove direct complete instruction it will remove so let's take this example so this is the code it is given to you and the five instructions are there what statement are dead and can be removed just look at this program and just like don't don't worry about uh, compiler design don't worry about algorithms uh, don't worry about anything just by looking at this program can you say that uh, some instruction is dead code like uh, this instruction can be removed without any worry without any worry we can remove this in. so any instruction what are the instruction that you can say that that can be removed what are the dead instruction basically so you see first and fourth instruction actually can be removed without any worry first of all why let's see this instruction fourth this instruction fourth can be removed because you see this instruction is what it is doing it is assigning z the value one and in the next instruction the z is being assigned the value x so anyway anyway this assignment is not used are you getting my point this assignment see this assignment first of all yesterday in the last lecture i told you one thing assignment is what definition when we are doing this when we are studying this compiler design assignment is nothing but definition basically when you are doing this when you are studying uh, intermediate code representation and when you, when you are studying code optimization these things when you are studying then assignment is a de definition basically here you are defining z okay don't, don't compare this with your c language in c language you are saying that every variable should be defined once no no that this is different thing here this is also uh, basically here also we are defining z here also we are defining z okay here we are using z here we are using z here we are using y here we are defining x here we are defining y here we are using y here we are defining x here we are using x so this is the basically use and def definition but anyway the point is that this is a definition assignment is definition here we are defining z here also we are defining z you can see one thing that this assignment or this definition is not used anywhere this is the point this assignment this definition it not this is not used anywhere you can just see so that's why this is dead code elimination so this is dead code because this definition is not used anywhere so that's why this is dead code let's see if any other code is a dead code or not let's see whether this is dead code or not we do not know whether this is dead code or not don't don't say that this is dead code because we are not because maybe maybe this is just one basic block let's assume that basically there there is some other program maybe okay some other program is there maybe okay so anyway the point is that this this is not dead code but this z equal to one is definitely a dead code because you can see as this z equal to one will not be used even even in the further program this z equal to one will never be used anywhere okay because this definition will not be used anywhere because of this because now from from onwards this z will be used so that's why this z equal to one is a dead code so we can eliminate this instruction let's see if any other instruction can be uh, eliminated or no can we eliminate this no we cannot eliminate this because this x is this is this definition is being used here this definition we are using here can we eliminate this no this definition we are using here can we eliminate this 
let's see whether this definition we are using somewhere or not this definition just look at just look at this x this x are we using somewhere or not no we are not using this x anywhere because you can see this is the definition and this definition is not used anywhere because here actually we are using but here we are using this definition so are you getting this point that this definition we are not using anywhere so this is a dead code this is a dead code and we can eliminate this is called dead code elimination if you have a definition which is not used which is never used you can guarantee that it will be never used but you have to guarantee that it, it will never be used while you are running the program basically see what i am saying just understand this just by looking at this text just by looking at this text you have to guarantee that if you run this program you have to guarantee that if you run this program then in all the executions in all the executions this will this will be basically this will not make any any effect this is so you can see actually we are not running the program but we are making one thing sure that if you run the program and you can consider all the executions you can consider which are possible but still this code can be eliminated Similarly, still this code can be eliminated because anyhow you execute them in all possible ways you can execute this program. You can see that this code is useless. This this is instruction is useless. So, so anyway, this is this is our uh, dead code elimination, and you can see here we can eliminate this. We can eliminate this. So this is the point you can see. Need to know whether values assigned to x at one is never used later you can see this is the assignment this is the definition and this definition this assignment is not used anywhere you can just see okay but we need like how uh, how algorithm will do it we will see at a later point of time right now we are not worrying about the algorithm we will worry about it at a later point of time right now our only worry uh, like right now we are just trying to understand uh, how to do this anyway so we need to determine like we need to know so how to know this we will see at a later point of time right now just by look because this is a small program only five instructions are there then just by looking at this program uh, we can determine which uh, which are dead code or not but uh, when you when you have a complex program then you need some sophisticated algorithm so that algorithm we will study at a later point of time but anyway the definition of dead code elimination is this that if this definition is you are not using anywhere then this is called dead code okay now of course this is obvious from the simple example without any without any control flow graph without any algorithm we can do this but when you have complex uh, when you have complex program when you have complex uh, structure then you need control flow graph okay you need control flow graph at that point <coughs> so let's see more examples let's see this example now basically this is slightly complicated more complicated than the last example can anyone tell me first of all is this x equal to y equal x equal to y equal uh, sorry this code this instruction is this instruction dead tell me only about this instruction is this dead or not you can see that this is not a dead code this is not a dead code because we don't know what is the value of first of all we are doing this static analysis okay and in the static analysis if you see this line if d equal to so at this point of time we do not know what is the value of d okay so we cannot take any risk like you can uh, that that meme i should actually i should have put that meme here uh koi risk nahi, koi risk nahi lene ka, that babu rao meme so you can see you can't take any risk risk here okay like in some execution it might happen in some execution it might happen that this becomes false then what will happen then this definition will be used here so that's why when you are doing this static analysis just by looking at this program when you are doing this analysis at that point of time you can not remove this instruction you cannot remove this instruction let's see this z equal to 1 is this dead code is this dead code this is dead code this definitely is dead code because you can see whatever execution you do whatever possibility you do any how do you uh, anything you can do you will see that this definition will not be used anywhere because it is it is being basically like this z equal to x you are just doing this so this definition you are not using anywhere 
so that's why this is this is still a dead code so you can remove it okay can anyone tell me is this dead code is this 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 is this dead code or not why this is not dead code yes maybe in some execution maybe i don't know about the uh, I, I don't know about what will happen in the run time when we will run this program i don't know what will happen but it might happen that this d becomes true this condition becomes true then what will happen this definition will be used here so that's why this is also not a dead code similarly this is also not a dead code because it might happen it might happen that this d becomes true and this definition will be used here this is the point so you can see you might use this x here this definition you might use here okay in some execution maybe on some execution basically here is the point on some execution maybe this d becomes false and you will use this like so that's why this is not a dead code so a statement is not a dead code on some execution value is used later so this definition is being used here on some execution so that's why this is not a dead code let's see this example let's take this uh, co uh, like slightly complicated example tell me x equal to y plus 1 is this dead code is this dead code you can see this this is definition this is definition this is not a use but anyway this is not a dead code because it might happen that you go inside okay you go inside you run this so this definition is run maybe this becomes false now maybe second time this while condition becomes false and hence the definition of this x will be used here so this might happen so on some execution on some execution basically you might use this definition here remember this is the definition this is the use but remember this is definition so you don't don't check like this so definition and use you need to check definition and use def use this is called def use so this you need to check anyway so this is not a dead code can you say z equal to 1 is a dead code or not can you say this so this is also not a dead code because this z equal to 1 this z equal to 1 you might use here you might use here you might use here also z, this z equal to 1 okay because this loop will run so this definition you can use again here you can use again here so this is why this is not a dead code so this is how you basically check whether some uh, instruction is dead code or not now you can you can just see if i give you this s equal to 1 s equal to 2 s equal to 3 s equal to 4 like this type of uh, instruction if i give you then you can see you can see this is dead code because this definition is not used need not being used anywhere so this is dead code this is dead code this is dead code this is not dead code so you can see that's why the, you can eliminate these things actually this was our dead code elimination so this is our dead code elimination so here you can see uh, on some execution you can see this z equal to 1 might be used here on some execution okay similarly this x equal to y plus 1 this is also not dead because on some execution you might be using it here 